guys, today I'm going to share with you some of my December favorites, so some of the products that I've been loving this whole month, and I got a lot, so let's go. We will start with makeup, and the first thing is what I'm wearing on my eyes today. It's the Naked 2 Basics. Naked 2 Basics or Naked Basics 2? It says Naked 2 Basics, so I'm going to read it as Naked 2 Basics. So I love this little palette because, first of all, it's just so cute. Second of all, I don't really have any colors like this in my collection. Um, I did not get the first Naked Basics palette. I don't know, I just felt like I didn't need it. Like, I had similar colors, and I like to do kind of more dramatic looks and I feel like this one like with the three darker colors right here you can so I just really like this it's easy to make pretty looks with and yeah next makeup item Sephora waterproof eyeliner in tiramisu not only is tiramisu delicious it looks green on the eyes so this is just a waterproof eyeliner I had the Rimmel one which I loved but it has sparkle in it, and sometimes you just want, I'm not wearing it today, I don't know why I did that, sometimes you just want, you know, a normal black, brown eye pencil. And so this does the job, it works like over my eyeshadow, and I found that like a lot of other ones I tried, they would kind of like tug on my eyeshadow if I already had eyeshadow on. This one just glides on like butter, so I really like this. Then... Mmm, where is it? What I'm wearing on my lips today, this Maybelline Matte Lipstick in Divine Wine. This color is Divine Wine. It's fine. I love this color. Like I said, I'm wearing it today. And you can make it like a little bit lighter or darker. This is, I've got to say, literally the most comfortable matte lipstick that I have. And I have a bunch of them from different brands. This one takes the cake. It's really, really nice. It goes on so smooth on your lips. Easy to apply. This is just really creamy. It lasts a long time on the lips. It looks beautiful. I love it. I have another lip product for this month. This is Max Lipstick in Syrup. It's a luster. Lustre. And it's just a really, like, neutral color. I feel like it brings life to the face, but it's not, like, overpowering. You can wear it with a ton of different eye looks. Anything you want to wear it with, it looks good, go get it. Speaking of lips, my lips have been so dry lately, like ridiculously dry. And I think it's because it started, let me back up. I got sick, like a cold, but like really bad, whatever. So I got sick and since then my lips have been like parched. I don't know what it is. They've been just so dry. Also the weather, so that's probably what it is. So, okay. Nothing was working. I tried this out. This is the Body Shop Aloe Lip Care. And it comes in a little squeezy tube. I will say, a lot comes out with a little squeeze. So be careful. Oh! <laughs> okay. So, yes, a lot comes out. Also, that whole thing sounded bad. We're gonna, we're gonna move on. So just be careful when you use this because if you put too much, your lips will get like, like when you do that and it's all like sticky, that's what will happen. But if you just put a little bit, it repairs your lips. I'm not even kidding. Like I put this on at night, wake up, still on my lips. This is not a drill. This is really, really awesome if you have like super dry lips. I would highly recommend this. Dry skin in general is a thing here for me this season. Pacifica. Indian Coconut Nectar Body Butter. I got this at Target. It was on sale for like $5. This is the little mini size. <sighs> I have a love for this. It smells good. It smells like coconut, but it's like a warm... Is coconut a warm scent in general? I don't know. It smells like a warm scent. Like it's not like tropical coconut. It's like, oh, this is cozy. <laughs> oh. So I... I I like this a lot. It's really moisturizing. My hands have been so dry and cracked and like disgusting. This repairs them. Like I put it on and I actually feel my hands being repaired by the second. I really, really like it a lot. I was reading the back. I like it a lot. Okay, I'm gonna keep just, I like it a lot. I like everything I have here a lot in case that's not clear. Last makeup-y item. 
is this Lorac 3D Liquid Luster Set. And this is the Royal Collection. It came out for the holidays and it comes with a set of four. Let me take one out so you can see. These things are amazing. My favorite is the gold one. So you just shake it up. It's like really, really liquidy. You shake it up. Sometimes I like mix it around with a little dropper. And you get some in the dropper. How I put it on is I put it on the back of my hand and then I use my finger and just kind of like dab it on. This stuff takes your look from drab to fab in an instant. I mean, I like to wear dramatic makeup like regularly anyway, so I would wear this and I do wear this wherever I'm going. But if you're the kind of person that likes to save like sparkly for special occasions, this is the stuff for you. Like I said, it comes with four and it is just amazing. It lasts all day. It looks beautiful. And that's all I'm gonna say on these. Hair. Hair stuff. This is my love. This is the Macadamia Natural Oil Deep Repair Mask. And it is fantastic. It's amazing. Um, not only does it smell really, really good. <sighs> it's amazing. It works so well on my hair. I put it in when I'm in the shower. I like put it mostly on the bottoms, but you know, I put the extra on the top. And then I put my hair up do whatever else I have to do, leave it in for a few minutes, and then rinse it out. <clears throat> and then I rinse it out. It leaves my hair feeling shiny, silky, easier to straighten. Shiny, silky, easier to straighten. Shiny, silky, easier to straighten. <laughs> That's, yeah, it, okay. And hair, nope. Perfume. This is old, an oldie bit of goodie. This is the original, is it the original? I think it was the first Taylor Swift perfume. This is the Wonderstruck, just the one in the herbal bottle. Usually has charms. Mine broke a while ago, so yeah. But I actually like it better that way because there was this one charm in it that was like a spiky ball and I always like pinched my finger on it and it really hurt. So I like it better like this. But this stuff smells so good. It's like sweet, but not too sweet. I like the bottle. I'm like this much done with it. And every time I wear this, every time without fail, somebody, at least one person compliments me and is like, oh my gosh, what are you wearing? You smell so good. So I felt like it deserved a favorite. It's really nice. I wear it whenever I feel like it and I love the way it smells, obviously, or else I wouldn't be wearing it. Onto the randoms. This is a very random item, but I cannot live without it anymore. I got it at Target. It's like in like the bath section and you put it on your head like this. Oh, it looks like a little ear warmer. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you put it on your head, but I put my hair up when I wear this and it just keeps all the hair out of your face when you're gonna wash your face. I feel like I'm talking really loud because this is covering my ears. Okay, let's get resituated here. So you put it on your head put your hair up or whatever you want to do and then I wash my face, take my makeup off, brush my teeth, all that stuff. And it just keeps my hair from getting wet because I hate when you're washing your face and your hairline gets wet and then I have curly hair so it like, you know, starts to do the little curl thing. Mm -mm, not here. Not in my house. Last two things. First is these. Ooh, they match my shirt. I did not plan that. These are my, let me take it off, new slippers that I got. They are like little puppies and they're pretty much my favorite things ever. Got them at Kohl's. They were not that expensive, maybe like $15 and they are just so cute and comfy. They have like a soft bottom. I have slippers with a hard bottom that you can like go outside with and stuff, but these are just so comfy for the house. I wear them all the time, every day, and I'm obsessed with them. Last thing I have is an app. You probably heard of it. You probably play it. It's called Trivia Crack. It's a game. It has different categories on the wheel. You spin the wheel. You get a category. Art. Pretty good category for me. Um, what is the name of the famous Radio City Music Hall dance team? 
They give you four choices. You pick the raw cats. If you get this question, that's what you should pick. And you get it right. So when you play and you get three questions right, the bar fills up. And when it fills up, oh, that was perfect. When it fills up to the three, you get to play for a crown. When you get all six characters, you win the game. You go back and forth with different people. I feel like I'm being really confusing when I'm explaining this. But um, just get the game, play with your friends, play with your family, and you'll love it. It'll be a great time. Oh no, I just started the question, now I have to finish. You get, you're you on a timer. <laughs> Got it. Okay, so that was all my favorites. I feel like it was a lot. Hope you liked this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe for more videos. And I will see you soon. Bye!